Command and Conquer fans, it is Cabal back with uh, Command and Conquer 4, Tiberian Twilight VOD, and I just uh, dipped into a game, I guess, and just waiting for the players to get started, so personally I don't know everybody's name because I just jumped into a random, random game. So it's obviously going to be GDI versus not as you all know, this is Ice Station Omega, which is a decent, decent map, so let's see, support defense, support offense and offense, but not, and uh, defense, defense, offense, and where's the other guys? Oh, noobs, offense, offense, for GDI, so, I guess a couple of the GDI players have noobs, and, um, hmm, that's his name, actually, and let's see, Nod is going to go for the, um, optional center post, it lo looks like JB over here, with his support, support MC, he's going to go attempt to take the blue, uh, Tiberian Crystal, which is located right at this location here, but GDI is also going to go for the, um, tip spot to the uh, Tiberian, but it looks like the green Tiberian has already been captured by, uh, by Nod, and there's a, there's these two bull bull Bulldogs here trying to take this blue crystal, and will they get it? Yes, they will! And they're going to detonate it! Boom! And all those engineers take a huge hit. Two engineers will go down. A Marauder might go down if it's not fast enough, and it does go down! Ouch! Okay, let's see. La, La Yaisen, I guess that's what his name is, is in is in control for the uh, not defensive MCV, but he's overwhelmed by two uh, GDI forces, Lee and Smurfs, offensive and defensive, and this is going to cause big problems because he doesn't have enough engineers to deal with this problem because all the engineers are just being repaired, we're just repairing each other, and there's too many bulldogs out here to. Um, Help keep this going, but here comes a few reinforcements here. A couple of these Avengers. Hang on, let me bring on the health tabs. Sorry. Health tabs. I don't know what the health tab is. Ah, oh, fuck it. I'm gonna... Okay, whatever. Next VOD, I hope I can get the the um, health bars figured out. But if I don't, then I'm such an idiot. Looks like GB was a, like, was gonna be attacked. And looks like he... I don't know if he captured the blue type burn crystal. And I guess I should have paid attention. But he didn't. Or I don't know if he did, but... His MCV took a little bit of a hit from Artie here, and it uh, looks like he's just building up some Cobras now, and a couple of Engineers to, uh, I guess, help um, capture that capture that construction. But the, but the action's back here where um, it's three versus two in favor of Nod, and uh, these, en these engineers, are doing, engineers are doing pretty, pretty well for the right here. Even Smurfs is having a little bit of a tough time. Trying to defense about, trying to defense about, and Lee is just building up non-stop infantry zone and zone zone enforcers. And um, oh, look at this! Bob decides to jump in, get a little closer to the base, and try to capture this um, uplink tower. Looks like it looks like they are doing just that. Not it has way too many engineers, way too many Avengers, and way I guess I, mean, I guess not that not that many raiders, but hey, it's something. I guess these engineers are in the um, Lee's command. I'm not sure. I'm not so sure. This is will be a lot better if I had goddamn health bars. Looks like GB over here is attacking Artie's uh, little bit of expansion here, and here comes the blue Tiberian Crystal, and will it be captured by by the Marauder? And it will, and will it be detonated? Not fast. Oh, it just get, just barely gets it, and those um, those forces are just going to be getting a beating big time. The main focus is back here, where Nod and GDI are just constantly fighting, and the Uplink Tower is under the control now. Well, going to be under the control of uh, of Team Nod right now, and just to let you know, it's the it's four control nodes to. Th it's four control nodes to one in favor of Nod, and it's just 426 to 134 in favor of Nod. And obviously, and Nod is destroying every single um, GDI defense that these missile turrets are just being popped up by Lee here. And Lee is all alone. He does not want to do. He does not want to give up at the moment here. But he's but he's being faced by two Nod players who um, are just n nonstop popping out um, these uh, Viper turrets and uh, engineers and whatnot. Over here, looks like Smurf has decided to skip the uh, war a little bit and build up some hunter, so build up some hunter tanks, which are not effective against air, only ground units. And here they come now. They're gonna hopefully take down these engineers, which definitely need to be taken down, or else um, Lee here is gonna just panic under the panic, and he's gonna lose his uh, defensive MCB. But now he's building some Spart some Spartan tanks to hopefully um, deal with the situation here. Back here, um, Artie and JB are still. Um, Ha are still having it out. It looks like uh, Artie's still waiting, even though he, even though that um, big hurt there from the Tiberian Crystal detonation that uh, hurt his hurt his infantry a bit. And 
The Marauders are still giving him a lot of trouble, but um, at the same time, the the uh, missile turrets are giving the Marauders a whole bunch of trouble. And but it's a good thing the engineers are still here and they're just repairing the JB's JB's a crawler. Smurf over here is taking a huge, huge risk. He snuck his MCV around the back, around this area, I suppose, and is going towards the control zone number two, I suppose. And uh, he's building his 100 tanks. Oh, and he almost captured it as well. But now he's being cornered by um, so many Avengers, and he, there's a Cobra right here not doing anything. And a Tiberium Crystal has been placed on right there, but the Marauder will not be able to take it because it just got destroyed. And um, this is so much chance to take it and to detonate it. Will it detonate this time? No, it doesn't. And plus six command points are destroying. And uh, offensive MCB is almost dead. Uh, Smurf needs to repair that immediately. But oh, what is this? Uh, P E two P C S E. Okay, we'll call him P2 then, because that's a pretty much name. And this offensive MCV is taking a huge amount of damage from these uh, vertigo bombers. And hopefully, oh, the engineer goes down, so no more repair pads, no more repairs for the Smurf. And will the MCV go down? Oh, it's close to tell. Oh, the uh, nice. Oh, and it does go down. Nice uh, Tiberian vein detonation from Nod. Oh boy, that's gotta hurt Smurf a lot. And it, all his hunter tanks have been destroyed. Oh, that hurts. It looks like Lee has been defeated around here. These uh, flame columns, just a lot of them, just a lot of flame columns, actually. So it looks like Nod is definitely a tier two, um, tier two, tier, still tier one. Um, GB over here is at tier two, and looks like Smurf is, what the, f is it what the F, GDI are campers? Yes, they are campers, because they don't know how to play the game right. H702 is a camper. IXDLOL is a camper. Smurf is not a camper. I'm, just, I'm, actually, quite, I'm actually quite surprised to see what um, is he, is, is he, if he's going to do anything. What is he going to do? He's just going to build some engineers. And looks like Lee's. M looks like no, that that wasn't Lee's. I mean, this is that was Artie's MCV went down in the dust to uh, a couple of these Avengers. Actually, Artie and um, JB have been going at it for a long time now. A little, little, little over 15 minutes, 20 minutes, to be honest. And looks like a uh, high looks like a uh, high XD LOL has been defeated because he didn't do squat, as he didn't do squat. And uh, finally, the first Tiberium crystal has been added to Smurf, and that'll give um, GDI one Tiberium, Tiberium crystal point. These two guys here are still uh, hanging still hanging it out, and a bunker has been placed and it has been canceled. Now Reapers are trying to come out, as well as um, some Reckoners. Oh, that was a that was a great idea by um. My law here. He's building up some bunkers and he's selling them for free, uh, for free up, for free, for free up. And looks like yeah, Eron was um in game as well. He wasn't. In, he wasn't in the game. He was just comment. He was just um on the spot, like well, you know, observing the match, like I am. Blue type crystal here from the engineer, and he's gonna take it to give Nod two more, and a great um. Great job by not. Great job by the. Great job by these this Nod player. This Nod player to uh, place bunkers to sell them and get a free. Excuse me to get a free um, up point or whatever those are called. Free uh, boxes. Tiberium green Tiberium core. To upgrade his force. He all his reckoners. Where is his reckoners? There they are. So let's see what they have in them. They have a dose. They have a slave, two reapers, slave, two reapers, slave, two reapers. And that's a and that's a that's a great combination right there. And they deploy. Ooh, that's a little bit tricky, but you know what? They do they do just fine. Artie's in a little bit of trouble here, but um, he's do he's doing do his best to catch up. And look at this, we have some strikers. Ooh, I haven't seen those in a very very long time. Strikers are very very good against. Uh, if you didn't know, the strikers are very very good against um, somewhat defense crawlers um, against uh, tanks. In my point of view. Let's see. Let's see. Bobby Merrily and uh, P2 are just tearing through the outside corners of the GDI spawn point. Smurf is still out here. Looks like he's the one who's spamming those um, strikers. Unless Lee's doing them. Nope. He's just spamming bulldogs and engineers. I have H7 H H7 27 has been doing nothing. The Tibetan tip crystal right here. The Marauder is standing right there trying to get it. I don't know if he's going to get it. So it looks like these um. Reckoners here, they have been promoted. They have got those dozer blades or something. And finally, H7207 has been defeated. And finally, GDI can produce more units like they can. So these hunter tanks, I haven't seen the hunter tanks yet. They're probably from Smurf. 
Yes, they are from Smurf. He's one of these building hunter tanks, and he's just getting dominated by these um, huge vertigo bombers. But here comes the uh, strikers, and they're going to do some damage unless they can unless they can avoid whatever is there. And it's the I forgot what that support power is called. It's like a bunch of drills, drill support power, something like that. And um, these reckoners are still here, and they're causing already some problems. He already is just spamming zone enforcers, which are not bad. They're not. They're not bad. A couple of it, some more engineers as well, and finally, tier, a tier three MCV is finally from from M. It looks like he's just going to uh, spam. What is he going to spam? He's still spamming some mantises. Not not the kind of thing you want to spam around here. And looks like um, strikers huge for looks like the huge force of strikers and hunter tanks are going to be attacking JB's. The JB's uh, main support crawler, and JB's gonna fly out of there and get out of the safety. But oh my god, what is he doing? He's trying. He's flying right into the strikers. Oh my god, that's a huge mistake. And those strikers are just gonna do a number on on that MCV, and they're just gonna destroy it. So it looks like um yeah, even though Smurf has a huge army of uh, forces, he's got a huge army of strikers. He's got a hu huge army of um hundred tanks, and a good job by Bob, and a good job by uh, Smurf actually to uh, avoid being crushed by that M offensive MCV when he dropped it on the main, dropped it on the uh, spawn point and there goes the off offensive MCV from JB so no so that's it for him and oh, so reverse moving right into a huge pile of uh, fully promoted uh, Avengers and that's going to cause some big dividends for uh, for that uh, for the hunter tank force and here come the here come the vertigos which are doing some good damage to those strikers but the strikers are um, doing the best they can to try to take out those uh, uh, vertigos and even though the vertigos are stealth they can uh, still <clears throat> do a do a pretty good number on that. Do still pretty good number on that offensive MCV, which uh, P two, which P two is taken, and um, already switched to support class, which is I'm not sure if it's a good idea because there's so many stealth tanks and mantises on the field, it's going to be pretty pointless. Depends on what he depends on what he builds. He's probably still tier. He's probably still a tier one, so he's probably just going to spam a whole bunch of workers and stuff like that. A tier two um, Kaburm crystal has finally been captured by Smurf, and what is he gonna do with it? He's just gonna let it let it die. Even these uh, engineers are trying to capture it, but nope. Nod has one. Well, Nod is way too powerful. There's too many Nod forces here. Strikers, a lot more strikers than I would like to see. Smurf is still spamming on strikers and hunter tanks, and I, I like that. Hurricanes coming out from from Artie, and they're just gonna be they're getting owned by those Vertigos. And Nardi needs to get the hell out of there right now. And Mantises, Mantises mixed with Avengers and Stealth Tanks are just going to cause Nardi some big problems. Because Stealth Tanks are doing pretty good damage. Mantises are doing pretty good damage. Those uh, Strikers are doing some good damage right here. And oh, here comes the Reckoners. Which, the, which, which has the uh, blah, 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 Reapers and the Reapers and the Slaves in it. And they're just going to try to help out this guy. They're defense... They're trying to uh, protect this crawler, and will they get it? Oh, the defense shield comes up right at the last second, and oh, will it survive? No, it can't survive. Oh, there's too, way too many strikers down the field. Oh my God, they couldn't save that uh, MC defensive MCB. So even though Nod did own a little bit today, it's actually um, the thing we jig the uh, v the victory points are at four thousand, which nobody would like. Leviathans, and they do have the up they do have all the upgrades. They have the um, uh, what is the Vithans upgrade? They have the, the Vithans, those uh, drones that, fl that fly around their platform. So yeah, even though that's um, GDI, uh, they did lose in the middle of the game. In the middle of the game, but a surprisingly amount of uh, Smur Smurf, t two or three, two or three of the GDI players left, and that gave Smurf the opportunity to spam strikers, bulldogs, and uh, hunter tanks, and that did pretty good. I'm not saying they didn't win the game, but it did pretty good, even though even though not as at. 63,000 or something like that and there goes the end of the game for GDI so Smurfs already in Lee OGG been defeated so you can't blame Nod for, you can't blame my GDI for getting defeated that much you know so let's check so let's take a look at the stats it's uh, experience earned the only people who didn't earn it was high XD LOL and 7 and H7 and it looks like Bobby Mar looks like Bobby Marley didn't earn anything as well Offensive, offensive MCV port. Um, one kill. Smurf is lot. Smurf is one and one. Uh, Lee G, Lee OGD is two and two. Rest or this and that and this and that and this and that. Looks like uh, oh, Heroes wants to play a game with me. So, sure. Scores. Blah. Rewards. That's for me, not for them. <laughs> okay. So that's pretty much it, I guess. 
with that uh, great game, with that great, eh, it wasn't that great, it was okay. I'm just gonna say it was okay. So, um, yeah, that's it for me for today. So I guess I'll see you guys all next time with another one.